What's good, y'all? Welcome back to another video, man. If you new, make sure you leave a like, comment, share, subscribe, turn on your post notifications so you don't miss a video. Now, I'm gonna try to get through this quick because I got my food right here. I got my pizza right here from Domino's. You know what I'm saying? I would have got the pasta as well, but then I realized I already had some pasta right here in the kitchen. So that's that's saving money right there already. And I got my chips right here, you know what I'm saying? Just a just this extra thing to snack on. The Larry Season 3, episode two, episode one. Pretty with solid episode, you know what I'm saying? We, we finna see what Lil and Carlton finna get into. Again, it, the pettiness between between Jazz and Hillary is insane. And I, and I was telling myself this earlier. Hillary, OG Hillary was like, she was petty, but she wasn't that petty. Then they got to take it back. No, she was that petty. She had her petty moments. I, I, I take that back. But when it came to like her lifestyle, it's like she did have standards. You know what I'm saying? She did have standards. But it's like, this Hillary, her standards is just ridiculous. It's like it's that's crazy, dude. I'm so hungry. I'm gonna start. I'm gonna start eating right now. I don't want to wait to the movie. Man, I don't want to wait till I, I don't want to wait till I watch the show. I'm sorry. I'm sorry. I don't know. Hillary standards is just is just like this Hillary. You know what I'm saying her standards is, is insane. No disrespect to Coco Jones though. I fuck with Coco Jones. I fuck I, like, I fuck with her. I fuck with her music. I've been fucking with her for like like for the longest. Like ever since Let It Shine before Let It Shine, I've been fucking with her. It's just, it's just, it's just Hillary. It's like it's that, that's that's who we, you know, what I'm saying Hillary is the person that we we, we got issues with. But we gonna see what um it's it, 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 also with Will quitting basketball and wanting to go into business. Ain't nothing wrong with that. But I would have loved to see what bro. I would have loved. I would have. It's like all season two. That's why he wanted to do was play basketball. And it's, it's like and in season three, it's like he finally got that. But now it's like you're giving it up to do business. Or go into business. That's fine. Hopefully, you know, but we gonna see what this business be, gonna be about. Uh, again, unviv out of pocket for what she said to Amira. I don't give a fuck. I get it. You, you, you're protecting your son. If you see that your son is happy with this person, being around this person makes him happy. You, you shouldn't have did that. Now maybe, maybe because I'm saying this because I don't understand you know, the side effects of getting out of rehab and shit like that. But like, if you if you if you are someone, or if you've been that person to where like, or if you've seen it to where it's like this person has like triggers or something, when, when, like when it comes to these type of things or type of words or whatever. But then they're around this person that makes him happy, that calms him down. You would think like, you know what? If he's happy, if he's happy with with her, I'm I'm gonna let him rock out. You know what I'm saying? Like you don't tell this girl like like uh, you should focus on yourself. You shouldn't be. Uh, I'm like. And then my nigga Jeffrey, I'm still trying to see what's going on with that situation, bro. Him and his son, cause he got people watching him and shit. And then Lou, they they hyped that up for nothing, bro. I don't even think they're gonna bring him back for real. It's false. I'm gonna hop into this reaction, man. So if you guys do end up liking my reaction, please like the video. Helps out a lot. You know what I'm saying? Get to push across the YouTube algorithm. So if you guys want to get my channel growing and going, you have to like the video. Comment down below what you want to see next. Hit that subscribe button. Share the video and the channel as well. And hit that Patreon link below as well if you want to see the full reaction to this video, man. So without further ado, let's get right into it. But while I could excuse it in college, as an adult, I can own it. Sorry, Tiff. Uh, oh, yeah. Oh, I forgot about that. Prioritize yourself right now. Let Carlton do the same. Me? You run. It's only a matter of time before you run away from that nigga too. If you're Imagine. Enough, the freedom to drive around in peace without worrying about getting pulled over. The app would hack into local police scanners so you would know exactly where the speed traps are. Dope. Well, oh my God. Idea. I like that. An online trading post for designer clothes. Get some money, get some I mean, money. that's fire. Right? Like, it's it's brilliant. You, Isn't it already a thing? You gotta shift into that hustle mentality. Learn you can create your life instead of letting life happen to you. Yeah. Mm. He pivots. He starts investing into startups. You know, he got into crypto before anybody even knew what that was. And look at him now. Mm. See, that's the A lot of people did. But now that you're not playing basketball this summer, it seems like you got a lot of free time. And we've been thinking that you uh, uh, get a summer job. job. They're still hiring. What are y'all talking about? Will getting a job at the club. <laughs> Why? <laughs> Carlton, your father and I think you could use a job too. Oh, damn. Wait, can't hide from life, son. All right, sooner or later, the day will come. Great. I vote later. Carlton, I believe in you. And I appreciate that. This is non negotiable. You vote later, later ain't it ain't never gonna come, nigga. Nah, they nah they music choices crazy dog. And uh how are you, Carlton? I mean really, how are you taking care of yourself? I am. Thanks. See that's what see he don't wanna hear that shit. What got a product tie on watching golf carts? Oh nigga, this nigga on here! 
Oh, hey, Clever, okay. if you watching this, this nigga look like a dark skinned Harris, bro. I mean, too bad all social media cares about is your engagement. I know, right? That video damn near broke the internet. Mm. Nah, really, like, fuck. Like, you didn't know. What do you have against LaMarcus? I mean, he's fine enough, but he's no jazz, okay? I was just like, he ain't jazz. I, I was gonna say it, but anyway, I was, but I wanted her to say okay, so it. What are... My body was not made for hard work. Yeah, yeah. but at least we're almost finished. Oh my oh, god, I was I was hope I didn't want to see back? this. I was hoping I see this nigga, bro. Okay, we are loaded and we are up next. Okay. Oh my god, Come. bro. Look at you. Back on your feet. These niggas about to These niggas gonna piss me off. I quit basketball for the summer. You know, me and Carlton started a business. Why the hell would you do that? Oh, we got into this young entrepreneurship program run by Quentin Harrison. Yo, Why would you tell him that? I work for Google, so if you ever need anything, you know, like uh, an introduction or a well, shit. Thank you let me know. Okay? I need to call Google well, anyway. Go. Shit. Hey, yo, fraternizing with the members is against policy. Okay, what? well, some of those members are actually our friends, so chill out. I'm not trying to hear none of that shit you're talking about, okay? Well, you on the clock, you're one of us. Oh, right? you one of them niggas? Okay. You're talking to me like that. <laughs> I know, that's right. Like, harder, finish. harder. You got left or right? Cut it, old man, yeah? All right, show me where you I got an old man, yeah. That's the shit I be hating with niggas at jobs, bro. It's like niggas get like niggas get to a certain position at their job and then niggas niggas get to acting like they better than you and shit. All right, bro, did you forget that you used to be like down here where you had to be told what to do? Then it's like you get not there, all of a sudden you, you get into a better position. Now it's like you get to acting like you better than us, you get to act like you the boss and shit. I don't, even if you the fucking manager still, bro. Like, first of all, you're not finna talk to me crazy. That's number one. Number two, I can't talk to the customers or, or talk to the to the to people that like, like bro, that, that's that's dumb as hell, bro. That's the dumbest policy if, if I ever heard one. That's like working at a car dealership and then you telling me I can't talk to the customers. Like, what the fuck? That's 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 bro, that's the stupidest shit, bro. Like I said, bro, I hate when people get into a higher position at their job and then shit, then niggas niggas wanna act like they better than you. Or they talk to you crazy and shit. Like <laughs> like Will say, he ain't talking to me like that. I don't give a fuck what job I'm at. You're not talking to me like that, bro. I don't give a fuck who you is. I guess I still got a lot to learn about you. Same here. Like exactly what you're keeping me safe from. <clears throat> Anything to do with the Hillboy Syndicate? <clears throat> Back in the day? Well, like I said before, you can't believe everything you hear, you get me? So you didn't kill him, man? <laughs> you get me. What kind of house manager do you think I am? Shit, a silent one, nigga. Next round, huh? You're done, though. All right, you're you done, though. But you can't talk. I love oh, it, bro. Yo, uh, actually, you know, we're still working on the details. Right. Yeah, yeah. fine tuning. Tune. 48 hours to piss me on your business plan. I gotta move on. Point blank. Shit, two days, huh? That's enough time. It, it, it is it, but it is at the same time. Oh, what the fuck? Shit. Damn. Oh, I got those Shamir records you wanted. Let's make this quick, Ash. <sighs> Careful, Jazz. You sound pressed. Pressed? What, it'll be a little arranged marriage? Come on now, Hillary. Stop it. What me and Marcus have is rock solid. Yeah, I. It seems like a big deal, Jazz. What's going on? What's going on is I need to ring you up and get back to work, but thank you. Damn. This is Vivian Banks. Hi, nice to meet you. You as well. He's a good looking brother, I ain't gonna lie. Pause. I'm comfortable enough to say that. <laughs> this is a Because I'm, I'm not a weird nigga. I think you're hired. Mm. Mm-hmm. Oh, shit. That's how it starts. You no, know, I used to see you in your little tennis shorts, doing cannonballs in the pool and shit. Mommy and daddy make you get a job. What's up with this nigga, bro? I look at them tech guys. They get real chatty after a couple beers. One question, and I'll tell you how they started their whole empire. All right, we gonna see. If you're a cool nigga, I'm trying to be a cool nigga, we gonna see. <laughs> you can leave Willis throwing away basketball. <laughs> I don't get it. I mean, what's it to you? Will is delusional. He wants to be a Bel Air kid so bad. That's a waste. Bro, bro, this nigga need his ass whoop, bro. This nigga need his ass whoop. I was gonna say, what's up with a mirror, bro? Like, nah, yeah, no, I'm fine. Just, uh, just chilling. Nothing to do with whoever you just sent a text to right now. I mean, why do you care? Honestly, why do you care? I know the last thing you ain't want to you, talk about is my relationship. Like, ain't you the one that sent her away? So why do you give a fuck? Is a yeah, well, it doesn't look like that's going to happen anytime soon. You want it, but you don't want it right now. Maybe I I'm tripping. I want you to better if you get your life together first before you bring somebody else into it. You still want to see her, though. Since you're open and... And, and they're just friends. That. Like they said, they're just friends, even though we know what's up. Amira really helped me through rehab, and I just don't want to lose that. So I'm saying, like, you wasn't there. All I ask is that you keep an open mind. I'll talk to your dad. I don't know why. He's not going to have an issue with it. I got to ask. 
Did you tell her about the kiss? Nah. There's nothing for Viv to know. I was, gonna, I was gonna ask that too. Like, does she even, like, does Viv know about the, the kiss? Just... Let's keep the past in the past. It'll be our secret. Yeah, yeah. for now. Hey, Jackie. Yeah, yeah. Jackie just asked me to write her recommendation for her Juilliard application. Oh, okay, that's so, like that Jackie, because from the, the back of her head, I kind of figured. So, country club boy these days. Uh, yeah, yeah, you know. She looked she look like a. I'm not gonna say it. Every day. I'm not gonna say it. What it do, buddy? <laughs> what? What the fuck? Girl, those pants are. <laughs> what the? F what was that? What it do, buddy? Nigga, sound like fucking Skip Bayless, nigga. <laughs> the fuck? Anywhere your little heart desires, preferably in the first two rows. Everyone's always trying to hide in the back. It hurts my feelings. Bro, everybody know the back is where it's at because we're not trying to be seen. That's the whole point. Amira, hey. Carlton, what are you doing here? Well, you know, just trying to stay sober I mean, like oh, everyone else. I mean, he want to see I you. Mean, oh you're stalking me. Isn't going to make this shit Whoa, any better. Okay? Stalking. I... You know what? You stay and I will find another meeting. Secondhand embarrassment. You don't have to sit in the front row if you don't want to. <laughs> <laughs> <It's this nigga. laughs> Shit, he wouldn't even stay for the meeting for real. He just wants to see, see a mirror, but mm. I mean, look, y'all get to give up, try new things. It don't work like that for everybody. Some of us, when we go down, we stay down. That's a fact. Wait, I'm sorry. Who invited you? Like, does my dad fuck with you like that? Hey, I <laughs> has been going through. Nigga like, said, does my dad fuck with you like that? That's crazy. See, and the thing I like about this jazz, he's not that goofy as like the other jazz. Made it. What if it worked? Oh, this looks great. Fantastic turnout. And your cater is a hit. Thanks again for pulling off a miracle, baby. <laughs> oh, hey, Erica. Hey. <laughs> so good to see you. I'm about like that's just like she just act like she ain't even there for real. All do incredible work. And I hear you're a brilliant fundraiser. We always need support. Yeah, we'd be happy to host something at the house. Yes, well. Why? Y'all always want to have shit at your house, bro. Like, bro. Bro. Y'all better than me, bro. I don't want nobody in my fucking house. Yeah, we owe so much of our launch success to our partnership with Carson Lake Law Firm. Thank you for the business you've sent our way. With my incredible family. It's funny because, like, especially my bro was supposed to run for DA. But then he said, fuck it. I'd rather have my own law firm. But you got your ride of that partner. You are halfway there. The best way to find your idea? Figure out what it is that makes you the special sauce. Mm, How are you going to make this succeed? What you're trying to fact. say is just as important as whatever it is you that are you're trying, trying to, do. to do. Exactly. I, only need you. I ain't gonna lie. And when you I would love to, be to be have conversations with people like this because it's be. like, bro, because starting a business and wanting to like work for yourself, bro, is like, a lot of people yeah. want that. But it's like they're not being told Sharif, or Sharif. taught on like what to do. Yeah. You know what I'm saying? Your tacos were magnifique. Mm, thank you. <laughs> was that alligator pepper I tasted? Mm. I didn't even know they had that in LA. Oh, I got all the homemade tacos. Mm. The Merp has some good markets. Mm -hmm. Crenshaw. It's Crenshaw. only a matter of time before him and Viv like have a, like, talk about. Have yeah. a, have a moment. Yes. Yeah, well, I'm always looking for opportunities to extend my investment portfolio, and with the vinyl market exploding the way it has. Oh my God, bro! Just you know I can't talk when Jeffrey's around. I swear I ain't said nothing. Oh my God, what's going on? Jeffrey has no idea. Oh my God, bro, what's going on, bro? Certainly been keeping my husband busy. Me? No, no, I mean, we do work some late nights, but I swear, like, we put it all behind us. Okay. <sighs> Does everyone enjoying themselves? She's, just, she's, she's about to just Thank dry you. snitch on herself. You too. Have fun tonight. Hmm? She about to dry snitch on herself. And I feel like Vivian ain't gonna have an idea of what the fuck she's talking about. Hillary, I need to talk to you. What are you still doing here? The party's over. I don't need your charity. Excuse me? Oh, oh no, no, party? no, Jazz. That's not, that wasn't her, bro. That was not, that was all Uncle Phil, bro. That was not her. Don't, don't do that. Don't do that. Okay, this is the one time, no. It, that was not her, bro. That was all Uncle Phil, please, bro. So if we hate each other so much, why do we keep ending up in the same fucking room? I don't know. How about you tell me? Mm, come on. Come on. Let it yeah! Be. <laughs> That's what I'm talking about. Yeah! But she cheated, though. She just cheated. I don't give a, I don't care. I don't care. She cheated. 
I'm, I'm sorry. Man, she wanted that, bro. Nah, nigga, she wanted that. She, she wanted that, bro. You, I'm gonna go. Don't apologize, nigga. She wanted that. We share our story. The addict who got a second chance. And the West Philly basketball phenom who dared to reach for more. And then we brand our message. So what you gonna call it? Black Sess. Black Sess. <laughs> okay. Okay. Cynthia girl, Erica. What was she on? Huh? Uh, oh, shit. Oh, come on. How could you not? Every time I got near her, she'd find a reason just to run off. Tell you, she gonna figure it out, bro. E the boss. Boss. Even after years of serving by his side, he, he tried to take my life. Mm. So my thing is, who was he talking to on the phone? Unless that was them. My entire life, I've been an expert at lying to get my own way. Since I got out of rehab, I just want to make my family proud of me. I know sobriety so and smile. rehab and shit is a struggle. So I never gone through that, but like, it just, nobody should have to go through that. Ahead. But hey, it's life, man. That's what happens. Because I know that they just want to know that I'm going to be okay. Yeah, man. You're going to be all right, bro. Nah, you're going to be all right, bro. Especially about, with, about you got people the, that's anxiety, a, a family and people that love house. you and support you, bro. You're going to be all right. About feeling like and it's crazy because the people that, Carlton, that, that you around. was doing that with, them niggas ain't around you right now. You're not alone anymore. All, like them same friends you got in trouble with that you would do dumb shit with where they at it's always like that the people you get in trouble with not gonna be around when you the main one taking like taking the consequences and responsibility for your actions let a lot of people down multiple times see because i don't know you like that i'm not gonna say much but so, it seems that way thought of someone needing me i shouldn't have put that on you i'm sorry come on now let's talk about it why don't we just be scared together Man, just be together. Fuck being scared, bro. And fuck what everybody gotta say. Shit, let be a couple. Look, bro, I don't want you to feel away, bro. I don't. Please don't. Let's move. Let's move. All right, all right. Break time, fellas. Oh, also, Briggs wanted me to introduce y'all to our new yoga instructor. I actually think y'all know her. Hey, y'all. Oh my god! Uh, that's my aunt. I'm always looking out. Oh, my mom is so messy. <laughs> wait, I'll, wait, I'll put her on? That's what I'm saying? This person, Unviv be doing too much, bro. Unviv be doing too much, bro. It's like, first you, you, you fucked with Carlton's situation. And then knowing how Will and Jackie Andy, you still gonna. Bro, you see what I'm saying? Messy. Like, Carlton, yes, she's right. Messy as fuck. This was a solid episode. Thompson number one, number two. You gonna see what this blackest uh, business gonna be about? You know what I'm saying? I wonder what kind of quotes y'all gonna have for that shit. Hillary and Jazz, bro. What's what, what's going on, bro? She she just cheated pretty much. She, she just cheated. And I don't give a fuck. If he, oh, he leaned in and kissed her. She still she still she was still infatuated by it because if she didn't want to kiss him, she would have pushed that nigga off 0.2 seconds, right or wrong. I don't give up. So like, she would have pushed that nigga off 0.2 seconds as soon as he leaned. Anybody that watches, anybody that watched enough TV knows if a person leans in to kiss you and you know in your mind and your heart you don't want to kiss that person, you you would push that motherfucker off you quickness. Same thing with uh, but not Hillary, not Hillary, uh, Uncle Phil and uh, his whoever the fuck his partner. Yeah, uh, Viv, uh, Viv gonna find out about that. Jeffrey, I'm glad he came clean to his son. But what is his son hiding from him? Again, I'm very surprised that they dropped these three episodes. I wonder, I wonder like if they gonna do that for the next three episodes, or are we just gonna get the next three episodes just weekly? If it happens to this next, the next uh, uh, episode. So if you guys did end up liking my reaction, please like the video. It helps out a lot. Gets me pushed across the YouTube algorithm. Comment down below what y'all want to see next. Hit that subscribe button, share the video and the channel as well, and hit that Patreon link below if y'all want to see the full reaction to this video, man. So until next time. Stay lit. Trip on me in the phantom. Trip. I go hard in the bezel.